the crucial funding for a critical rail project under the Hudson River faces uncertainty in Washington, as local officials plan to vote Thursday to pump more money into the project. The Board of the Port Authority of New York and New Jersey is voting to spend another $44 million to keep the momentum going on the Gateway Project, which consists of a new bridge in New Jersey and a new tunnel beneath the Hudson River. Backers of the project insist the federal government needs to kick in money for Gateway to become a reality. The problem is, it is such a large project and it is expensive and it covers so much ground, said Tom Wright, president of the Regional Plan Association. It is really hard to figure out how you do this without a substantial federal share. Yet the Trump administration this week put out an infrastructure plan that laid out just $200 billion in direct spending over 10 years, with $50 billion of that set aside for the country's rural areas. The plan essentially tells states and cities raise to money for infrastructure projects through taxes and fees. Under the Gateway Project, it will cost $13 billion for the Hudson River Tunnel and $1.6 billion to build a bridge over the Hackensack River in New Jersey. Given the administration's recent budget and infrastructure proposals, it is clear they aren't interested in 